everyone, it's Catherine, and today I'm going to be doing an update. This is number six of my winter project Use It Up for Bath & Body Works, and I also have a Victoria's Secret pink fragrance mist, not to just, you know, clickbait you guys. So let's go ahead, let's get started, and look at all this stuff. Oh, it's so heavy. This is actually, if you've never seen my project Use It Ups before, I usually tend to go through like a lot more products just because... I love using it up and I'm the queen of using up her products if you've not seen those videos yet but I am trying to do a little bit more slow progress so let's go ahead let's get started with everything we're going to start with my soaps now I'm bringing in three new soaps for the month of February and I'm just going to transition them for the spring edition of Project Use It Up. The first one I have right here is Black Cherry Merlot. My boyfriend was requesting this so freaking badly. This one is Dark Cherry, Black Raspberry, and Merlot. One of his favorite scents. So good, so bubbly. The second soap that I'm bringing in is Georgia Peach. This is going to be in the kitchen area. This one smells really good. Sweet Peach, Orange Blossom, and Honeysuckle Nectar. You know what I'm saying? So I've actually started using this one right here. This is Fresh Strawberry Tart. This one is in the bathroom that I use. This is so good, you guys. I thought I wouldn't like it as much, but look at the progress right here. Pretty good, like a quarter of the way done. This is strawberries, orange zest, and bergamot. So good, like <laughs> amazing. So I think these are more of like transitioning to spring. I'm really excited for these new soaps. All right, so for my minis, I have In the Stars. I've actually opened her up. For this update, I didn't weigh in my products, so I'm just gonna show you guys like a side by side. This one wasn't opened before. You guys look at all that product in there and I cut it up too. So there's just a lot of product. Make sure you guys open up your products because literally you do not wanna waste any single drop of that nourishing formula of the body cream. I've really been enjoying the In the Stars one. It's really nice. I also have a shower gel and hot cocoa and cream this is just a little mini here's the little evidence of how much I've used I think I used this like twice I was trying to be super generous with it just because I really want to use this up I literally can't talk today guys I don't know what's going on with me but my words she's just not coming out she's literally not coming out but overall I really like the scent so much if they ever bring like a full-size version of it like next winter time i would totally buy this stuff because it smells really good in the shower gel okay so up next we have portofino pink prosecco and the body lotion i have used up this much right here as you guys can see and honestly this isn't like my favorite scent ever there's just something about this scent that makes me like it like one time like yeah i'll use it like once in a while but this isn't a everyday type of scent for me i think that once this goes away i'll be happy but i have been enjoying it but it's just hard to persist on like products that you're just like Meh about it's not that i hate it and it's not that i like love it like it's one of my favorite products this one's doing fine though with the progress i'm actually really going to try to persist to use this up by the end of the month to be honest next lotion i have is strawberry pound cake love strawberry pound cake this one smells so freaking good i was really considering about whether to put the body lotion in this project just because i want to keep it but they keep re-releasing strawberry pound cake we've seen her around she's still here she's going to be here because she makes bath and body work so much coins so much gold here's the progress lines for her not too much i did use it a lot more in the beginning of the month because i was just like in this gourmand type of feel i honestly might use this tonight i might use some type of scent mixology with this i think this will be fun to pair with something and i think i have something like really fun very gourmand still and then the next one i have here is champagne toast this is the old version i think this was made in 2019 yes here are the progress lines for champagne toast not too much progress with this scent but I do think that this scent is very good I just feel like this isn't like my all-time everyday scent so that's why I've been trying to use it sparingly so I don't get too sick of it because I feel like this scent you can get sick of it kind of easily so there's the progress for her and the last body lotion that I have is my stargazing meditation one she's still the same progress I haven't used this once and I'm going to try to plan to do like a bubble bath with stargazing meditation like I have like the body wash in it and like the moisturizing body wash and like the bubble bath like foam bath stuff so i think this would be like a really good experience to have if i'm like really stressed out because honestly you guys i've been so freaking stressed out with school lately and i have been just trying to get things on top so i can film and like pre-record some videos so i can post every day it's really hard though and one of you guys have actually noticed that i didn't post um one of the days in the week and you guys are like, oh my gosh, where are the uploads? I'm like, girl, I'm posting, don't worry about it. So I'm doing my best to upload every day to give you guys some like content and some more of me because who who wouldn't want that? I really do love stargazing meditation. If you haven't tried her yet, do it. 
she smells so good and then next up we have body creams right here i didn't mention this one actually and i forgot to but this one is pink velvet cupcake it was like right here before and now it's like all the way down here so i definitely know for sure that she's going to be finished this one is whipped pink marshmallow red berries and sugared praline you guys, so many people are sleeping on Pink Velvet Cupcake. It smells so good, you guys. If they bring this out in the fall, in the upcoming year, I'm so... I'm gonna get another bottle because I only have one fragrance mist and I'm not adding it to this collection because I have another body lotion. So I gotta, like, make sure I have, like matchy matchy with everything that i have so yeah this one's a really good one and then i also have portofino pink prosecco and the body cream this is just so hard to use along with the lotion Ugh, it's so difficult to use just because the scent makes me get very wary of it like i'm just like enough is enough like this is a scent that i'll like pop out like once in a blue moon to be honest but i can tell like the scent is turning like it, it just has like this weird like not moldy but like you can tell when a scent turns and I'm just like I gotta use this up before it turns even more because it does not smell good it smells it makes me gag with the smell of it um but this hasn't gone all the way bad yet so here is the progress I have like a little screenshot right here I've used up this much so you guys can kind of tell I don't know why I have been so lazy to not measure my things even though I have like a food scale measure right here i just can't do the math you guys i literally can't maybe in the spring project pin i will continue to like weigh my products in and just tell you guys exactly how much if you guys really want to like know like how much i've actually used up within like the two week span let me know down below i will do it and then for the last body cream i have strawberry pound cake she is love she is bae here's a screenshot right there and this is how much i've used i'm obsessed with strawberry pound cake and then the body cream immaculate gorgeous so sweet so cakey like this is so authentic it is getting a little bit yellow though which you guys can see right here Ugh, we don't like that it's so yellow like i don't remember it being this yellow so i'm really excited to finish this up and just get like a new one i know it's from like the vanilla coloring and stuff like that but you know i just feel like i'd rather finish this bottle up and then just get like the newer packaging of it so they're always just going to bring out strawberry pound cake thank goodness it's a really good scent so this much progress i think i am uh pretty good <laughs> with this one and then lastly with the body sprays and fried fragrance mist i have the one victoria's secret pink scent that i'm trying to use up this month it is vanilla swirl this one's such a very sweet vanilla candy like scent it smells so freaking good and if you love vanilla scents you should try this one out it's amazing i got this for like under four dollars and here is the progress lines for her not too bad you guys i think i'm doing a great job with this one i've actually been pairing this up with pink velvet cupcake just because it gives me like a vanilla and then like a little sweet berry so it's been doing really well with this so if you have these two you guys should try it out together i think it smells really good and very gourmand and very sweet next up i have sweet pea she is doing fine and look at my big freaking sharpie marks um embarrassing i've done really great progress on this one i think that because it's so nostalgic to me i've just been wanting to spray more and more of it this is what's helping me use up portofino pink prosecco because they pair very well together either way i really like this one and i i don't know if i can finish it up this month just because i do want to use other scents but we'll see if i can just do like a halfway here and there that's gonna be my goal for the rest of the month and plus this one's gotta go because she was made in 2014 and i don't need like six year old body mist in my collection and then the last scent that i have oh my gosh literally a hidden gem them. no one talks about her literally they had so many of these mists during for 75 percent off at the outlet like in the middle of like last august and like september so i was just like why is no one gravitating towards the scent this is snowy switches swirl oh my gosh you guys this is legit an orange creamsicle an orange dreamsicle i'm dreaming of orange creamsicles like oh my gosh i just really want one right now it smells so authentic to a popsicle with a cream inside of it, it smells so freaking good and here are my progress lines for this one i have been what have i been using this with i've been using this with um champagne toast as well as this amazing scent what is this? this right here twinkling nights one of you guys have mentioned that snowy citrus world goes so well with twinkling nights and i will agree to that i can attest to that it smells so good because twinkling nights is more of like a soft sweet floral 
And if you pair it with Snowy Citrus Whirl, it's like a nice soft dreamsicle scent. I think it pairs amazing. So if you guys have Twinkling Nights, but you didn't end up getting the Fine Fragrance Mist because they didn't have it for sale during SAS, try it with Snowy Citrus Swirl. Or if you have Snowy Citrus Swirl and you don't have like the body lotion, try it with Champagne Toast and then also with Twinkling Nights. But yeah, you guys, that was basically it. I feel like I'm going to have a very hard time editing because I like kept repeating myself and didn't make sense. Like I'm a stuttering queen. If you ever see me in real life, I just like stutter so much because like I have a speech impediment. But yeah, that was basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what's in your project pan of the month. What are you guys using up this month? Are you using anything up? Let me know down below. I love you guys so much and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.